Hello everyone, it's Lel, and today I'm here to watch and react to Cure Lillian's transformation. Finally, another green cure is here. I'm super excited. I even put Cure March here close to me. I unfortunately don't have other green cures, uh, plush, other green cure plushies to, you know, decorate. I do have a Cure Lillian card though. I'm very, very hyped for this. Cure Nyami's transformation was everything. How will Cure Lillian's transformation be? Well, this is what we're gonna discover now. Let's go. Hype, hype, hype. I have no idea how her transformation is, how things are gonna go. Let's do it. Let me turn on the volume. Okay. Let's go. Oh my gosh, it's so green. Oh, what? A what the curtain a curtain what wow it's a cat oh my god her eyes her eyes are so what the hell was this what the hair oh girl the way what the what? What? Wow! <gasps> Damn it! Okay. Girl, the problem with those very short transformations like this one is that they all happen so fast. <sighs> what the hell? I really thought it wasn't possible to be as good as Nyami's. This might be as good as Nyami's. Let's watch it again, obviously. Girl, the curtain falling down. Who, ha who thought of that? So good. Let's go. I love her determination when she says, Shiny Cat's packed. And then... Girl, the curtains, they are so creative. Wow. The hair. Look at the little cat. Ah, it's so cute. Love the background with the Aurora. Girl, the hair. What the hell? What the hell? Kirinya, Kirlilian. Vipu, Akitani. Wow, girl. The way she put, throws her hair up and then it gets ready. Oh my god. I love the pose. Oh, it's so cute the way she says. Look, I am wearing a Kirinami t shirt that I got from a very special friend of mine. He gave it to me as a birthday present. I have Butterfly here with me. Butterfly, my ultimate queen, and Kirinami. And Kir I'm getting their names mixed up. Kirinami. My current queen from Wonderful, so both queens, to prestige her girl. I, I, I don't know. I, I think this transformation here is, it, just like your Nyami, it will stand out a lot. So let's talk about certain parts of it. Look, I love this first shot of her transformation. I just love her, her the green in her costume, in her body. I love the way she she works with her hands, with the pack, and she's holding the pack, and the other hand is like, I love this. Very cool. And then, uh, it, it's nice because when the, the mirror shows her face, it shows kind of like this scared face, this doubtful face that Mayu has, and then it changes to a more determined Mayu. Very, very cool detail. And I, okay, so the curtain thing. So this is a very creative touch that I would not think of for her transformation. I think that uh, obviously it's not necessarily related, but sewing has a lot to do with theater, you know? Like costume, creating costumes, 
creating a new version of yourself has a lot to do with theater. Uh, and so I feel like it matches Lillian's theme very, very well, you know, because it, it, it is Mayu creating a new Mayu. So she is playing a new Mayu. She is debuting a new Mayu on this stage. So I love this. And I also love the Aurora in the back. For Nyami, they went for a blue one. And for Lillian, they're going for a green one. They still kept the yellow flowers and leaves. Uh, I, I just love this detail. We have the presence of the cat. And the cat has the ribbon in its neck. Just like uh, uh, Yuri, Yuki has. So this is... Oh my goodness. The level of detail in this is out there. I just love it. And look, when she appears with her hair like this for the first time, it kind of gave me a little flashback to Cure Friendly's transformation, where I thought that I really wanted them to keep this hair right here in, her, in their Cure forms, not the current ones. Even though Lillian's hair looks really nice, like in the final form, so very cool. Uh, this part of the ribbons, of the pink ribbons doing the, the hands, it's very nice because we can see the difference in Yami's transformation and Lillian's transformation. The way the ribbons work, are it's, com it, it, it's completely different. Uh, you know, the style of animators here, they, they really let it shine because they each give their own touch, their own flavor to it. So in Yami's transformation, the ribbons worked with her body in a way. In Lillian's transformation, it's different. I love this. Oh my God, look at her with her hair down. Look at that. Stunning, stunning. Ooh, honey, I love it. I also love the color of her eyes. This shot right here kind of gives me, I don't know if it's the, the, the ribbon in her neck, it, and, and the hair is kind of similar to, she is giving me Cure Marine vibes. But then it changes. The way she throws her hair up, I love this shot. Lots of strands of hair, all messed up. I love it. The little hat. Oh, girl. The way she spins around. And this part right here, that she puts her hand up and it's all white, it feels very theater as well to me. It feels like she's standing on a stage in a theater, you know, and she's performing. I love this. This feels so cohesive with everything we've seen. Wow. And I just love how they keep the white in this part, like the white background until it changes when she does her pose. like. It is all white until her pose. And I love the pose, very simple, but uh, not very simple. It's kind of like a simple pose with a twist. I love how her hair is uh, flowy and the dress is flowy as well. Really, really love this detail. I also love the Koakunai Koakunai here. Oh my God. So good. This, this is really, really something. And right now, I don't even know which one I liked the most. Is it Lillian? Is it Nyami? I can't tell you because I really don't know. I don't have an answer. I don't have an answer. I don't know what to say. I might have liked Nyami's a little better because it's a little bit more diva-ish, but I don't know. I don't know. I just like how smart the Lillian transformation was. It was really smart. So now I don't know what to say. I think I will have, I will have to digest both transformations a little more before I can give my verdict. Not that it matters, but you know. Anyways, the Green Queen is here. Her transformation is gorgeous. I just loved all of the theater theme, loved it. And you know, the super, super, super on point. Everything was super well done, super smart. I loved every single second of it. 
But anyways, babies, this is it for now. I want to take this little time to thank the members of the Magical Cinnamon channel. If you're a member here on YouTube, on Patreon, or if you support me on Throne, thank you very much. Thank you for the Magical Cinnamon production team. And if you've watched up until now, thank you so much as well. Thank you so much for watching, and until next time, bye-bye.